Hello creative people and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to create this uh, PVC crop top. The inspiration comes from Instagram. A lot of brands are selling these tops right now and I really wanted to create my own. So I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and let's get started. <laughs> To create this pattern you will need basic pattern for bodice and you can find that on my channel. The first changes I'm going to change on the bust line, 1 cm on the middle and then 7 cm on the side. From that point I'm measuring upwards 5 cm and connecting that with 1. Then I'm going to create a circle. This is going to represent the part where your breast is going to be, so we are creating the cup. And for the cup, I'm just going to divide it in half and create the incisions on the side. My top part of the cup will be a little bit more squared because of the side. And the incision is about 2 cm thick. Then you're going to create a straight line dividing this piece in half. And you're going to add on this piece a bretelle that is going to be one piece and not two. The bretelle must be length of your own measurement. And as you can see here I have colored all of the pieces. For the back I'm going to take away the half of the back and also I'm going to lower my back with two centimeters. And I think that's the all changes I'm going to do for the back side. For the material you will need PVC fabric 1 meter, scissors, pins, measuring band, pen or a crayon and my pattern. The first step as always is to place a pattern on the fabric, measure 1 cm for the sewing and cut out all of the pieces. I'm gonna start with the cups, so I'm just gonna place them one above the other and sew them together. Then I'm going to connect the middle part of the top. Then you will take the cups and connect them together with that part. Now we will add the sides and the bretelle. And this is how the front piece looks while it's done. Moving on to the back. For the back I'm just going to sew them uh, on the middle where the incisions used to be. Because I'm leaving the middle part open I'm going to add the zipper. Now I'm going to connect the front piece and the back piece together. I also decided to cut the little piece on the side because it's much more comfortable for me to wear. And um, then I'm just gonna sew the bretelles and that's it. <laughs> 
And this is the finishing product. This is how the top came out. I am very satisfied. I think it just looks amazing and it's just beautiful. So I really like it. I hope you like it as well. And if you did like it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like always, if you have any other suggestions or what kind of videos you would like to see on my channel or things that you would like me to create, please comment below or contact me on my social media. All of my links are listed in my description box below. Um, see you till next time. Hey, everyone.